What's up everybody? Today we're talking about Caribbean style mango habanero from Heartbeat. Caribbean style mango habanero from Heartbeat. Oh yeah, uh, good to have Heartbeat back on the table. We've always liked everything they've done yeah. and love always. the squeeze bottles. The bottle, so good. So, so good. So good. And uh, yeah, it's, man, I don't know. There's just something about those Canucks. They know how to do it. Yeah, um, for sure. This will be, I can't even remember, maybe fifth sauce we reviewed from them? Five, something like that? Maybe six, five. Yeah, it's up there. Somewhere, somewhere in there. Somewhere in there. Um, and this one's kind of cool. Um, it was actually originally a special edition done with a restaurant called Tomlin, which is up in Thunder Bay. Um, and apparently uh, it, when the, the limited edition run was up, everybody freaked out and uh, said, hey, you got to bring this as a full-time sauce. And so they brought it back. Um, and it's just on the roster now. Yeah, nice. Oh, um, yeah. so it must be good if, uh, there was the outrage, it went away. <laughs> I think out of all their sauces, we haven't had anything Caribbean style yet. No. I mean, we had a, there was, there was a pineapple habanero maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Caribbean style. But this is, habanero. this is more, yeah. Caribbean mango hob. Yeah. Hmm. Um, well, guys, the ingredient list, li ah, the ingredient list on this one is mango, rice wine vinegar, orange bell pepper, onion, lime juice, orange habanero, canola oil, organic cane sugar, garlic, sea salt, cilantro, and spices. You don't see rice wine vinegar too often. Yeah, a little bit here and there, but yeah, not it's not yeah. a lot. I do like the fact that ingredient number one is mango. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Um, should we get into it? Let's do see, it. See what she's all about. All right. Squeeze it and please it. <laughs> Oh, jeez. There's your new slogan. Squeeze it. <laughs> Just came up. With it. Whoa. It's, she's coming out. This one's a little runnier. All right. Mm, it's got a great smell to it. I like that. Okay. Cheers. Whoa. I like that. Really, really good mango flavor. Amazing mango flavor. It's definitely got a little bit of heat in there. It's kind of runny, but it, it's got, normally runny uh, equates to watered down in my eyes, and there's nothing watered down about this. It's just, that's the consistency of the sauce. The balance is really good. Um, and it has that little bit of canola oil in there. You yeah. mentioned how somebody uh, a sauce with some oil is becoming one of your things you look for the better the mouth feel the more i like it nowadays <laughs> um man let's go back in you know what this reminds me of is like or what i would eat this on to for it to remind me of like like when i was in i've never been to the caribbean but I was on, when i was in costa rica there's like all kinds of steak salads you could get that had mango salsa on them mm -hmm. i'm like this would be this would be great for like a, on steak, a steak a steak salad okay you know like, oh yeah yeah i see what you're saying yeah like this is the salad dressing yeah okay yeah just straight up use this as the dressing and like not even do anything to it man that is so tasty um that's really good i I feel like one thing that's really kind of shining through there is that rice wine vinegar. Yeah, I get that too. Like, yeah, uh, 
Man, yeah, everything is very well the blended. The heat is like there, but it's really on the back end, like really, really balanced. Yeah, yeah. Um, all right, what do you what are you gonna rate this heat wise out of ten? I mean, 10? honestly, probably a two or three, maybe a three. Yeah, I would tend to agree. But I'm I'm not mad about that. No, you know, like it tastes so good. Yeah, for sure. Um, I really like this, just. I would destroy this on the steak salad. Oh yeah, <laughs> uh, is steak salad your your primary thing? You're thinking right off the bat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I'm gonna go in one more time. I actually sure. want to as well. Um, yeah. This is a threefer. Whoa! This is coming out a, in all directions. This is a threefer. I think there's a little chunk stuck in the uh -oh. in the tip there. You might have to. Maybe I can get it to <laughs> weasel its way out. But, man. Yeah, this is super tasty. Yeah, wow. I don't know what else to say about that. That's great. So good. Um, yeah, I would try that as some salad dressing on this, something. This could even be like... I think that this would go really well in a margarita. Oh, okay. Caribbean margarita. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah, I can see that. I like that a lot. Yeah, like, I mean, uh, a watermelon, uh, jalapeno marg is a common thing. Yeah. Just go you know, mango. I've ha had a few mango habanero mango. margaritas. Yeah. In mango. the last few years that were pretty good, but this would, take it over the edge like this would be so good i i like that idea like, i mean shake it up you know the salad sounds good but you had me at margarita yeah <laughs> yeah oh man yo guys uh great sauce here from heartbeat um they have a pretty deep uh collection of sauces um i think we may be only halfway through it or so i think once we finish what we i mean we have we have one I think well, that, that might be the last one the last. we have that they sent us. Yeah. But then I still think there's like five or more that we haven't tried. So. Yeah. There's well, a, there's a, they have a blueberry one that we haven't tried that I've been wanting to try for a long time. And some other ones, but. Yeah. Well, guys, uh, if you've tried any of the ones we haven't yet, comment down below which ones we should be looking for um, next. And yeah, make sure like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And you got anything else to add? That's it. All right, guys. Well, thanks for checking this one out. Till next time, keep up the flavor.